Hey, welcome back. Uh, we just came back from picking those spatula buttons and we were coming up with all kinds of ideas on how to use them. And so this is just one idea. We'll be doing some more videos on other ideas on other times, but it's almost lunchtime and we're starving. So we are going to do a quick, easy thing. What I've got here is just a regular tortilla and I've got a, a uh, chive and onion cream cheese spread. And just spread it over the tortilla. I mean, you could use garden vegetable. You could use a fruity one if you want. Plain. I don't care what you use. Whatever your taste preferences are. Um, I used to make these all the time for uh, little party things. People just love them. You can do so many different things with them. Um, I've got some turkey here that I'm going to, I can't tell if that's one slice or not. Just kind of go around the whole thing here with a few slices of turkey so that it's all evenly covered. And then... Um, Where's the cheese open up at, Chris? Oh, there it is. I should have had you do it already because now my fingers are slippery and I can't get it open. That makes me feel better. He was having trouble too. <laughs> I always like to use a mild cheese on mine. I'm actually only going to put two slices of cheese. I'm not a huge cheese fan. And then we're going to take some um, spinach. We could sit here and pinch off some of these longer stems if we like. Some people don't like that stemmy part of the... And this is just to... It gives it some color. Helps people who are bad about eating their veggies get some fresh veggies. You could use, you know, a salad mix. Um, putting some basil leaves in there can be quite nice. I mean, just experiment. You know, that there, there's so many ways to do these things. It's not even funny. Now, I'm going to, and then in here, I've got the little bachelor buttons that I had picked. And remember, we only want petals. No stamens. Of course, now my hands are all wet, so they're going to stick to my fingers. And um, yes, most of it will be covered up, of course, when we roll this up. But there again... It's just kind of cool. It adds a little bit of uh, a different flavor to it. That's not much, but that's okay. And then all we do is we just start down here. And just start tightly rolling it. Might have to rearrange some things so they don't go all out to the sides, which sometimes they like to do. I might have put too much spinach in here. We'll take a couple leaves out. Keep our little flowers in there, though. And then just slice I always put the ends on something else because they're not quite so pretty. About an inch or so. And another not so pretty end. 
So now, oh, see, look at there. You can actually, whoops, I should have done a little bit more cream cheese around the thing to seal them. To seal them shut so they stick. But if you do them tightly together, they uh, on a on a platter. Oh yeah, you can actually see the the flowers in there. So that's kind of cool. And then um, you know you could just do your whole plate like that. And then at the end, if you want, you could just uh, just take a couple of flowers and and. Uh, just go like that, and uh, of course they don't look quite so pretty anymore because they've been washed and spun in the spinner. But you know, just just kind of decorate your plate like that a little bit, and uh, that looks quite quite uh, quite nice. Something quick, easy, and really good. Bon appétit. <laughs>